Those hundreds of AIADMK banners which were erected to welcome Tamil Nadu Chief Minister Edapadi Palaniswamy and Deputy Chief Minister O Panir Silvam were vandalized in Ramanamanthapuram uh, Ramana district. The CM and the Deputy CM were on a visit to pay tribute to freedom fighter Muthuramalinga Thevar. So you can see those pictures where these banners have been uh, completely vandalized. These were banners that were put, put up uh, on the occasion of uh, Thevar Jayanti. Now you can see those uh, entire stretch, the entire stretch of banners that were erected, hundreds of AIA DMK banners that were erected to welcome Tamil Nadu Chief Minister Edapani Palani Swami and his Deputy Chief Minister Opanir Silvam were badly vandalized and damaged. Let me go across to uh, Pramod with more, uh, joining us with more information. Yes, Pramod, over to you. Uh, tell us what exactly happened there. Why was uh, this kind of vandalism uh, happened? Why did this happen over there? Certainly, it seems like the people are taking the uh, law in their own hands because, as you might know, for several years, there has been a court battle where the Madras High Court constantly says that do not erect banners, unnecessary banners that is causing uh, irritation to the public or any kind of nuisance. For instance, in the state of Tamil Nadu, it's three people have so far died because of such banners and atrocities. And what happened yesterday was that uh, uh, the ARDMK's uh, Chief Minister and Deputy Chief Minister went ahead to celebrate the uh, one of the freedom fighters called Pasupol Muthrama Ringam's birthday at Pasupol. And it is uh, supposedly considered as one of the uh, strongholds of AIDMK. And what happened but, uh, uh, to their shock is that like every other banner that was placed in that area was torn by the public claiming that uh, they are not uh, interested in this kind of banner things anymore. Uh, mm -hmm. This is the second kind of instance where you could see such people going ahead and uh, vandalizing and uh, tearing the banners. Already one occurred in, this, uh, in Chennai near, near the airport. So since it seems like as a law is failing, people have decided to take the law in their own hands. Right. Uh, Pramod, thanks for giving us the latest on this.